I do still want to fight the man queen as well, or whatever her name is. I want that bundling wrap. I wonder if can you bundle living things in the bundling wrap? Because that would be kind of helpful. Just bundle up some bees. Or I'll definitely bundle up like light flowers, things like that. Where am I going? Neon Quattro. Inedible raw. Well, it's edible. You just don't want to be eating it. And now I can get this these reeds because I can I have honey to actually make the poultices. That is so good. Honey poultice is probably going to be my my go-to for health. Cuz I'll I'll have so much of the resources necessary. So that'll be good. Fuck. He just, he sucks them up with his snout, you know? He's so quick at eating them. Oh, he even got that one, what? Come on. I wish there was something more useful to do with this. I think I've said that before, but I really don't really have uh, any use for Big Bird just yet. The island is not really in a great spot. Especially seeing... I think it does take me to the second island. The second city if I go through that one. But I can get there by teleporting so much easier. And I'm kind of lucky that there are so many of these lotus flowers and cut reeds in this one. This is a very nice pond. Yeah, there's nothing for you. Oh, there's this one here. No! Trying to suck my blood. Alright. Well, look at that. We've got 14 lotus flowers, 25 reeds, and a few meat just to go with that. Oh, I just noticed the, the mosquito didn't actually hurt me because I was on my boat. <laughs> so it just hurt the boat a little bit. I'm fine with that. I could probably make a few honey poultices. Do I have honey? Six honey. What do I need for a poultice? Two honey. Okay. Yeah, I can make a few. Maybe I'll make two. I'll save some for coffee. Honey poultice. Nice. Yeah, okay. And I'll get some sanity back as well. Very nice. It just, ah, oh, the place looks so much different after being insane for all that time. All right, I said I would, uh, I said I would take these berries. Let's see if the powder cake works well. Assuming we actually get any gobblers. No, don't do that. Looks good. Only one? Only one. Okay. 
I'm pretty sure that it, there only are four pieces for this. So if I wanted to, I could reset Reign of Giants. Although, I'm not sure if this is the case. I've never actually reset a world. But I've heard that it also resets um, the caves in Reign of Giants, of course. But also the volcano in Shipwrecked at the same time. And if that's the case, my Skyworthy is in there. So <laughs> that would be a big problem. I mean, if it only reset the volcano and my Skyworthy wasn't in there, that would be quite good actually, because then I could get more coffee, even though I don't really need it. But yeah, I I guess I would need to move my Skyworthy first before I do that, just in case, because that would really suck. Then I'd have to, I don't know what it would do there. It might even just crash the game. Which would be a bit of a shame. Also, have I killed all the guys here? Might just get some poop because I'm kind of running low. No one even pays me. They don't care. Doing you guys a service. No. They don't give a shit. Literally. Did they... Was it too long ago that they did it? I don't know. I should go to the other city because there'd be a lot of poop there. Always is. So... My reasoning for using the, the cobblestone is that it goes underneath pretty much every turf. And I'm thinking of using it in like the joining bits. I don't know. It'll look a little bit weird next to this though. So I might have to use something else next to that. Like here. I think it would look a little bit weird. So I don't know about that. Or should I... Mm, I can't really use this either. Oh no, I was going to use marble. Right, I should get some marble as well. I can finally redo the kitchen. Yeah, because I, I was going to say I could maybe use this. This um, flat stone turf. Let's have a look while we're here. See how that looks using it here. And maybe like in here, just to get an idea of what it looks like. So, it goes over the top of that, which is a little bit annoying. But see, cobblestone wouldn't go over the top there. I like it here, in between there, not a huge fan here, maybe I'll use cobblestone there, I don't know, but yeah I might keep that there, that looks alright, and I'll replace that I guess. I'm always looking for ways to improve the base. I guess here, I can't really, hmm. If I put it here, it's gonna go over the top, isn't it? Yeah, no, that doesn't look good. And cultivated turf will go over the top as well. So that's gonna have to be something else. Cause I don't know if I'm actually gonna make like a, a proper base in Raider Giants or Shipwrecked. Not, not like a, a mega base anyway. Maybe I'll make one eventually, but I don't know. It might just be worth just putting more coffee plants here and then not having to worry about running out because it's just so much. <laughs> but I think I might wait until I get the bundling wrap first. Speaking of which, it might be something that I want to do soon. 
I mean, I've, I'm quite prepared. I've got healing stuff. Alright, I'm just going to make a few of these because it's kind of um, going a bit stale. And if I make too many, then the batch is going to go stale. My coffee, it looks like it's, yeah, it's finally done. Well, like 95% of it anyway. I just ate the last one that I had. Um, so yeah, we'll collect that. Big bird's coming, which is great. Always comes at the best time. How about you come over here? Nope. This time. Okay, see you again. See you next year. <laughs> I really, I don't get the point of Big Bird. I thought it would be a boss, which would make sense. But... I don't know. Or at least put something on that island that's useful. There's nothing there. What are you supposed to do there? Okay. Let's get the coffee. There's still four days left of this season. So we do have a fair bit of time. Do I want to go to Rain of Giants or do I want to do the Queen Womant? I think I kind of want to do the Queen it would involve me actually finding it first, which can be a little bit tricky. I remember last time I was really lucky and I found it like immediately, but that's that's not always the case, obviously. So, I don't know, we'll give it a go. I mean, the worst that happens is I get forced to turn back. I also run the risk of having those beetles come out though yeah if i take too long they'll probably start spawning on my way back which would really suck i don't like them at all i'll be fast luckily because i have my coffee now but they're just a pain all the time doesn't matter how fast you are even if i have the dark sword that i can kill them in one shot they're still a pain I think what I might do for the actual fight, I might uh, see if I can buy a few royal guards to come with me. Four is probably enough actually. They cost 10, 10 buckaroos each. So let's just see. Can I purchase it here? Um, be right at the end I think. Cone. Look at all these hedges. Security contract. <laughs> Just for fun. I mean, they take care of the those little egg things that spawn as well, which are really annoying. So, I might see if I could hire some. That's why I didn't want to completely remove these guys from the world, because they are kind of useful sometimes. So, if you could come with me, you... You... And you as well. All right, so I've got four of them. I'm just going to go on ahead because you guys are way too slow. But it should be fun. I'll meet you there. As soon as you go into like a, a room, they just catch up instantly. So it's fine to go ahead. Uh, my boat. Oh, shit. All right, you guys are a lot faster. <laughs> yeah, try to do this. All right. Whoopsie. So, okay. Hmm, there's actually a thing right here. That's amazing. Take this honey. Oh, don't worry about that stuff, guys. Alright, um, in my experience, I normally find it pretty damn close. So, let's... Can I go in here? Oh, there it is. <laughs> yeah, it's right there. Okay. So, those guys will come in handy fighting those 
those dudes that spawn from the eggs. They're, they're these guys. Um, yeah, and I hope they actually help me in the fight as well. But we'll see. Alright, here we are. I'm going to leave that there. I'm going to put that on and that. Alright, let's go. Help! Good. <laughs> Oop, that weapon ran out. They are actually helping, kinda. Oi, fight those dudes. Fight those dudes. You son of a bitch. I need to heal a bit. Oh, I won, okay. <laughs> I was just gonna say, my health is getting a little bit low there. Good job. And they all made it too. Okay. Uh, yeah, I brought a pickaxe. Good, good, good. Okay. Um, I'm not a huge fan of how, how tanky that fight was, but it went okay, I guess. And there's a light bulb here for me. Refuel that. And do they not eat the meat when they're my friends? Seems like it. We got the bundling wrap blueprint. Good. When she does that, um, that whatever attack it is, that like noise thing, it really, you lose a lot of sanity. Like a lot. <laughs> Can I pick all this stuff up? Flint, I don't really care for. Oh. I do want the crown though. <laughs> um, I don't need this venom gland. All right, that's awesome. Let's go home. It's such a quick fight. In fact, most of the fights in just single player Don't Starve are very quick. They're over very soon. It's just a straight, straight shot out here. And now we go up. Ow. Oh. That was mean. Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thanks for that, guys. Um, I don't know what they're gonna do now. I guess they're gonna come with me, but they're not really needed anymore. Now I got a crown as well. <laughs> Look at that symbolic headwear that is respected by the porcine population. How am I insane? With 49? Really? I thought it was when it got to like under 30 or something for Wagstar. Alright, um, you guys don't set anything on fire, yeah? I think I have them for another day. Just eat this, turn that on. <laughs> so we got... Oliver, William, Merritt, and Salisbury. Okay. Cool. Glad to have you guys on board. You're kind of in the way of everything, though. <laughs> Got a little bit of honey as well. Oh, I should have brought the, the nectar. Why did I not bring the nectar? I thought I had it. Oh, well. Must have just put it down for something. Um, yeah, apparently I'm insane, but those guys don't want to fight me, so I must not be insane. So I have a crown. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Wagstaff the king. He looks good with that crown. 
It actually looks pretty cool. I guess I'll keep it somewhere. Keep it in my hat room. Do I have a hat room? No, I don't have a hat room. And they have the one room. I'll have to make a hat room. Oh no. Keep it in there. Yeah, get out of there. So I bought them at the start of the day. So I reckon I'll go back around here so that when they eventually lose their Ooh, come this way. When they lose their, you know, friendship with me, they'll be around here. Wow, what the fuck? How far did that spider go? I wonder if they would be upset if I broke things when they were my friends. I don't know, because if it's like, if it's like bunny men, if you pick up meat when they're your friends, they don't get upset. So I wonder if they would get upset if I were to pick up things. Interesting. Not sure if I really want to test it out just yet, but could be something in that. Can you, now is about the time, so it must be more than a day, I don't know. Oh well, I think they'll go back home anyway because they, they sort of, um, they regroup around their house. All right, uh, I could collect this, turn this off. Do I have any sanity food? I do have a bit, yeah. Maybe have some of those. I again. <laughs> what? <laughs> no! <laughs> yeah, thanks for that. Thanks, guys. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Gotta get them to come here. I wish I could leave them in here. Alright, gotta go quick. A fire, a fire! Alrighty guys, I'm gonna have to leave it there for today. Thank you so much for watching, hope you enjoyed that episode. Leave a like if you did, and I'll see you back here next time. Take care.